riding with my RV, my RV, wherever I want to be. You guys am free in my RV. Hello everybody and greetings from the 2021 Hershey RV show once again and a lot of you, I know a lot of you are interested in Super C's and here we have a Dynamax 5 Series and this one is on a 4x4 turbo diesel 5500 heavy duty here and uh, let's check it out I don't know, generally Super C's are, are, are thought of the, the, the ones that come in, in a, like a semi-truck chassis. But this is a slightly smaller type as Super C. And being 4x4, that means you can go into places you wouldn't be able to uh, with, a regular, with a regular Class C. And of course, it's you know, very typical Class C design. You would have here a cab over a bed. Here's your cockpit, your, your RAM cockpit. Please do not blow the horn. <laughs> That's cool. Let's check it out. Here we have this counter extension, very premium materials here on this Dynamax. And uh, here's your sink. It's a double sink. And I, and I came into the show early. That's why there's nobody here. Nice faucet. I like the, the, the LED accents inside all these cabinets. Propane range. Some, some drawers here, not, not very, they're deep to the towards the body, but they're, I mean, they're not very deep, I guess this would be the one for your pots and pans. It's a bit flimsy down there, but uh, you know, it is an RV, every, every ounce counts. This is a convection microwave here, and uh, you have your two-way refrigerator, it's a Norcold. A two door refrigerator. I don't have any experience with this in uh, cold refrigerators, but uh, it is uh, it is rather large. Now let's come back here. We have this uh, narrow uh, hallway into the back. And one of the things that I'm noticing here first, you only have this small slide out uh, dinette, and it's a very, very small slide, and uh, it's like ah, an arm's length. So it will come all the way up to here, which means that this RV is pretty much fully functional with the sliding. If um, for those moments when you are, uh, you know, not allowed on, or, or where it, when it is frowned upon that you uh, uh, deploy the slide and back here, we don't have any, any slide. This is just a nice walk around bed. You do have to step up here, but it is a nice walk around bed. We do have USB on both sides, even a cup holder here, so um, very nice. Emergency exit, your air conditioner, I don't know how loud it is because actually it's a pretty cool morning here in Pennsylvania, so you have all this multiplex uh, lighting. Here on the left, on the uh, driver's side, we have our, our head, our bathroom, and it is porcelain. Very small sink. Everybody's using these very small sinks. I would like to, to see a, a slightly larger sinks just, just because, you know, it, it, sometimes it creates a mess. And here's a shower. Yeah, definitely you can be 6'5 and still fitting here. I, I like that they have the oxygenics and they have the, the soap uh, tray here. And it's fairly, fairly large. It's not the largest I've seen, but it's fairly large. And uh, oh, this is a you know electric flush toilet, I suppose. So you you don't have to be you know it's not a step. And that's it. I would like to see this door become like a privacy door. That would be cool, but it doesn't. Uh, here we have a closet. It's uh, it doesn't have it's not a hanging wardrobe, but I like the fact that you can uh, you know uh, adjust the shelves. And this, uh, this, this I like. Because a lot of these RVs, they have the pantry, but you have to like reach all the way to the back. And this one, you have this, these drawers of, of, of sorts that uh, I, I assume they are very convenient. Um, we have a little bit of storage up here. Uh, 
and uh, in any case here's a uh, download the brochure and that's something that uh, this year at the RV show a lot of RVs don't have a whole lot of information uh, available on paper it is uh, okay here we go this is the 2022 Dynamax Isada 528SS Explorer and this is it you, you can have the booth dinette or the optional theater seats show price $219 thousand dollars here's uh, some of the specs if you guys want to pause the video and uh, check it out and uh, 360 horsepower and 10,000 pound tow capacity that's a lot <laughs> four wheel drive four season all weather camp anywhere anytime and uh, through my aqua go which is as you, as you guys know it's uh, I'm a yeah insulated bay tank here is very nice this is definitely a, we accept anything on trade. Let's go take a look at some of the other Dynamaxes, the, the, larger, the larger ones that are here. A true Super C here, Dynamax Force. Morning. And here we are, this is the Force HD 37 TS and that's uh, your specs there, 289 here at the show. Comes in a Freightliner M2 chassis. And, uh, well, you can pause the video there if you want to see all the, all, the, all the specs. But as you can see, this is, a, this is a big boy right here. Let's step inside. And the first thing we see here is, uh, yeah, this is a lot more residential. You have a rather large slide here on the, on the driver's side. And let's take a look at our cockpit. Please do not blow the horn. I guess some people have been blowing that air horn <laughs> and scaring the crap out of them. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a classic uh, Freightliner um, uh, cockpit. We do have the, 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 the large screen there, but the... the you know, your gauges are all analog, you know, like no, nothing digital or anything of the sort. If you want more information, you, you can feel free to scan that QR code right there. I like the TV that goes up and down because behind, behind this TV, it's a window. So if you are at a beautiful place, you can sit down here and look at the, at the, at the landscape. Or you can watch your TV, which is, I'm sorry to say, not directly in front of uh, of the the sofa as, as you see I'm, I'm in the right hand side so if i'm here i'm kind of not directly in front of the tv but, but it's pretty good it's a pretty good position we do we do have some carpet down here which not a, not a big fan of and um, yeah we have a sound bar you know that that uh, a fireplace and um, you know storage down here i like the galley the, the, this is by the way another another slide that's why we have so much room in here we could we, you could you could even have it like like a ballroom dancing uh, here we have so much room but we do have opposing slides that's why we have so much room once these slides go in it's going to be a very 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 narrow uh, pa passageway pretty large counter extension and very premium materials here we have your lights kitchen ceiling water pump slide out we do have a fantastic fan, very quiet air conditioner, convection microwave, regular propane range, storage, employees only. Okay, there you go. So <laughs> we're not going to do that, but this is a residential style refrigerator. It is compressor based, as you can see. You see, this is a slightly larger uh, a, a sink and that's the way I like it some drawers you know drawers as storage is very important in any RV now this bed this bedroom is on another slide out right there which would bring the bed up to here when the slide is in so you would you would lose access to all these drawers down here you have a TV you have a 
huge dual closets and fairly large drawers and this is an insignia tv i think this is the smart one the one that comes with uh, with alexa yeah this is these are pretty good tvs i have uh, one of those in my current rig and i like it let's uh, take a look at one more of this uh, dynamax it is now 8 53 pm the show is about to open and uh, this place is going to get swamped here very soon. So here we have, I'm gonna, there's one more and there's one in the front that doesn't seem to have a slide on this side. This one is uh, the 37BD, $319,000. It looks like we're going up in price here, but um, uh, you can pause here on, the, on all the specs. And uh, let me show you real quick for more information, scan the, those QR codes and uh, let's check it out. Yeah, the cockpit is very similar to the one we just saw. This is very similar, again, again the same deal. You have the, the TV that goes up and down. We have some room back here, this behind the TV, and uh, soundbar, a fireplace. This one, instead of, uh, instead of uh, propane, we have Induction cooktop, two of them, which I like because sometimes when they put an induction cooktop, they put only one. What if you're making something complicated that you have to like boil something on one side, like, like pasta, for example. Convection microwave, here we have the, the, the employees only refrigerator. Nice, full size mirror there. And this one we have bunks. So this is, a, this is the, the family unit. We have bunks and what is that? That is like a, like a stereo. Yeah, that looks like a, let me see if I can. Just that, I, I imagine this is like a screen that comes down, but I don't know how to use it. Anyway, um, here we have the, the master bedroom. Again, nice, nice uh, TV, very similar deal in this case. Just the, the slide is on the closet side, not on the bed side. But uh, when you put the sliding, it would have the same effect. Again, not a fan of all these carpets but uh, I know some people like it. Let's take a look at the bathroom real quick. Oh, okay, this one has this uh, um, semi-circular uh, shower, which seems very, very spacious, and it does have a seat, a seat, and it doesn't, it, it, it closes by itself. So let me come in here. Yeah, it's very spacious. We have that oxygenics, oops, shower head, and you can sit down if you wanna, you know. Yeah, I'm stuck. Porcelain toilet, again. And you have all the all the lights are of this type, uh, multiplex. Very nice, very premium, very premium materials on this Dynamax. And of course we have the the, the, the dinette right here. And of course this is a, that freight liner chassis that that will probably run uh, forever. <laughs> Uh, you know, that's what they're designed to do. Hello, hello, dueling cameras here. And, um, well, this one is closed, so I'm not gonna go into it, but this is the Europa. And uh, show price, $269,000. Just check out the, 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 the floor plan right there. And this one has a rear a bathroom there. That's uh, basically the only difference. All right, let's continue. Let's continue here, coming to you from the 2021 Hershey RV Show in Hershey, Pennsylvania. I'm free in my RV, yeah. 